My new piece's title is related to a very ancient Chinese Peking opera drama. It names Ba Wang Bie Ji in Chinese, so in English like Farewell My Concubine. This story is about one the wife from one king and uh, followed him to a wall which they are got lost soon. This woman with her husband were really in a very dangerous situation. So they are set in a trap from the enemy. My new piece somehow follows this story structure. I choose another perspective, not from the king, but from the wife of the king. This piece is about 50 minutes. It somehow follows the form from the whole drum story, like the beginning. It has a monologue part from the female character, like she complained what the situation is, and she expressed her depression about this situation. I used the same texture from the piano and the percussion to express the dramatic atmosphere. At the first beginning from this project, I invited six musicians from EIC to the studio. I rewrite some part of the voice part from Peking Opa. Then I shot them a lot of recordings, how the singer singing or some sentence from this drama. Then I place them to imitate the sentence with scores and with the recording. The musician uses their imagination and their musical techniques to repeat the same sentence from the Peking Opera singers. The result really surprised me. That let me feel that I finally found a way to in interface the Chinese Peking Opera into Western instruments. This piece's electronic part, I worked with Ron in Earcom Studio for weeks. I tried to find a way how to reproduce the Peking Opera singer sound in an abstract way. J'ai travaillé avec Yang Song pour la création de Les Adieux de la Concubine. On a commencé à travailler il y a bien un an. Son projet or euh, original, c'était de créer une chanteuse virtuelle. Donc une chanteuse qui n'existe pas, c'est l'électronique qui chante euh, la partie euh, qui est très similaire à, à l'opéra chinois. On a fait des tests avec ces outils de la mode, de l'intelligence artificielle, et les résultats n'étaient pas tout à fait euh, satisfaisants. Mais ce n'est pas du tout convaincant. Donc ça ne sonne pas à un chanteur d'opéra ch chinois. Par contre, on a fait des séances en studio avec des musiciens, avec quelques musiciens, qui euh, étaient très intéressants. Donc euh, Yang, elle faisait écouter l'opéra, les extraits d'opéra, et les musiciens à tour de rôle essayaient de imiter. Cette chanteuse virtuelle vient de l'ensemble, vient des musiciens. Yang Song elle a travaillé avec des échantillons, des enregistrements de, des chanteurs d'opéra chinois, euh, des vrais chanteurs par ailleurs, qui après ont été traités. Donc on a, euh, on a fait des traitements parfois très subtils, donc à peine perceptibles, et ces traitements-là sont joués euh, dans la pièce, sont joués au cours de la pièce, en permanence, et, et c'est ça qui dialogue avec les instruments acoustiques. During the rehearsal, the musician gave me a lot of tips about how to make the sound better, or there's another choice for the techniques. They all inspired me a lot. And working with the 
contact her Karina. She is very cooperative and uh, she gave me a lot of questions before the rehearsal began. He, she studied the score. She wanted to know how it is about and how its background is. Then during the rehearsal, she gave the musician also about this idea about the Peking opera drama, how it could be, how it should be. I think it helped a lot about the rehearsal process. I present my piece with this Peking Opera sample and I think I will keep on going on this way to express my own cultural background.